Hey guys, it's Rainy Nights. Before we get into the video, if you could please leave a like and subscribe, I would be very thankful to you for that. Today I'm going to be counting down the top 10 best Realm of the Mad God players. Now, the word best does not mean skill. I'm sure that's a very debatable, borderline impossible list to make. This is just going to be for people I like and players that are trustworthy and uh, you should try to be nice to if you see them. Although I'm sure this video will have the exact opposite effect because uh, I have a lot of crazy internet stalkers that don't like me, so I'm sure they'll come and harass you. So sorry in advance if uh, any of those weirdos come after you, but uh, yeah, we're, there's actually gonna be 11 here. So number 11, the reason there's 11 is because the first one to talk about here is not actually a player, he's an employee. So number 11, the honorary mention goes to Deca Akalos. This is the community manager of the game. Uh, he is actually one of those uh, employees that will actually talk to you if you have something to say. So he's a very friendly, respon responsive individual. Uh, I think his gear is very cool. I mean, check out this gear right here. Admin wand, man. That is very cool. I can feel a sneeze coming, so hopefully it doesn't happen. Creator's ring, and also he opens up the admin arena. And in general, he's a example of uh, a good community manager. I have um, personally worked with other community managers in the past as a filthy Reddit mod, uh, and they're they're usually not as good as uh, this one is. So I won't. I was gonna name drop some people, but there's no point in doing that. So let's just say uh, Star Wars Battlefront did not have the best one. Um, Here's a fun fact you don't know about me. Do you guys know what the most downvoted Reddit comment is of all time? You probably do. Here's a fun fact. I'm the one that approved that comment. I didn't make the comment, but I approved it. So, <laughs> yeah, I'm. I <laughs> there's a lot. Of, there's a lot of things you don't know about me. So number eleven goes uh, to Deca Akalos for being a good boy. Number ten goes to GSC. This is uh, this is my my guild. I'd almost call him like a, a co-owner at this point, uh, Girl Scout Cookies. He has just been very chill and helpful to me. So shout out to GSC. I think you're pretty cool. Glad to have you in Anya Taylor Joy, the certified number one best guild in the game. By the way, if you want to join, hit me up. I'm I'm sure you can find me on Discord or in game. Number nine is going to be Arky, who does not play the game anymore. Probably permanent banned, but I don't know that for sure. Um, but uh, yeah, so Arky, what a legend. This is a German guy with a very heavy, deep voice that is a furry. He is a gay man. And all of those things I just said are respectable things. Those are all positives, okay? So Arky is a very, he is the definition of a Realm of the Mad God player. Also, another fun fact you don't know about me, I am the creator of Dungeoneer, the Discord. Yes, the original one before death went ahead and just made another one without telling me. But uh, the original Dungeoneer, Arky was one of the biggest staff members that was helping me run it in there. So Arky is unironically a, uh, a good person. And uh, yeah, I like Arky a lot. But rest in peace, probably not able to play the game anymore. Number eight goes to Blade for being, uh, in my opinion, the least toxic 50 guild member. I, I think Blade has officially officially taken over the spots of uh, budding romance for me so if you're budding if you're watching this video i apologize you're now my second favorite 50 member the number one favorite 50 member is now blade so shout out to blade for not being like his uh fellow degenerates um well not that he is one but you know what i mean he he's he rised above his uh his his criminal friends basically. I think they're criminals at least. That's like one of their biggest memes now is because I called them I think they're I think fifty is full of IRL criminals. So yeah. But Blade, you're not an IRL criminal. You're a decent person. And uh yeah, shout out to you. Next up, this is number seven, right? Seven six five four three two one. Yes. Number seven goes to Darwolf. I don't have a lot of personal interaction with Darwolf. No stories to tell this time. I just think he's a very solid player that is friendly, welcoming, and uh, is very much worth getting to know. Uh, he runs one of the only confirmed anti-hack guilds, so if you are anti-hack or you want to play the game with specifically legit teammates and all that, then this is the guy to go to. Aeolus is a very respectable guild, and I highly recommend giving them a chance. So Darwolf is a very positive influence on the game. 
Number six goes to Lily. Lily's very cool. One time she took a screenshot with me while I was holding uh, the botany book. So she's actually an artist for some of the items in the game. And she's just very friendly. So that's really the reason why she's on here. It's not like I know her super well, but I had... I have a few positive interactions with her, and uh, she's an artist. So, yeah, good good player. Looks like she doesn't play anymore, but still. Number five goes to Zuzu. This is a, uh, I would describe him as a U.S. East key popper, but he's a particularly friendly one. He doesn't demand you do certain things. You know all those annoying-ass people that go into public lost halls, and then they're like, uh, is this cult or NBC? Oh, noobs go cult. Go NBC of Chad. A bunch of all the idiots spamming that stuff. Zuzu's the kind of guy who pops a halls and is just like, you know what? Just go where you want. It's it's a free for all public dungeon. I'm not going to control you. So yeah, shout out to Zuzu for uh, giving us his keys and being a very friendly individual. Number four is Sam Ridley, who is the third highest fame in the game. Probably higher than that, to be honest. I think he's purposely hiding characters, which there's nothing wrong with. Um, but I imagine his fame is actually much higher than that. So he might even be the number one highest fame on the game. I don't know. Someone correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, I think Sam Ridley might actually be subscribed to this channel too. So if you're watching this, feel free to correct me. But uh, yeah, Sam Ridley is a very friendly person who has never had a single beef or drama with anyone in this game despite being a part of a very popular high noteworthy guild and uh being one of the most recognizable players in the game so yeah he's basically he's the same as japan except he actually plays his own account and uh he also is uh willing to speak in chat and he never says anything toxic or abrasive or anything he is a friendly person and uh yeah so not going to, so, yeah, so if you're watching this, Sam, shout out to you. I, I, I'm preventing myself from saying other things there. Number three, because I respect you so much. So number three is Cosmic TF, which is a Discord mod for D.GG Pro TMG. In my opinion, he's one of the best, uh, actually, I don't even know your gender, so he or she, probably he, but he or she, whatever. Um, Cosmic TF is one of the best uh, D.GG server mods in my opinion he actually takes his job seriously and with professionalism and also unlike a lot of the mods on the discord he actually plays the game which i mean i'm not saying it's bad if you don't play the game but like it's just even more cool that you do play the game so i see you in game all the time you always say hi to me when i'm in game and uh yeah so cosmic tf i've had nothing but positive interactions with you so number three for you number two is george way he's on this list because He's going to hate me for saying this. George Way is a real-life friend of mine who I went to high school with. And we live in the same town as each other still to this day. So <laughs> he's going to hate me for saying that, but he knows that he knows I'm the kind of person to say that. So it's not going to shock him. But yeah, George, I put you on this list just so that um, you can experience some of the pain that I do by being a very or how do I humbly say it? By being a very recognizable player in this game, you attract a lot of weirdos and negative attention. So hopefully by putting you on this list and giving you the second best spot on uh, the top 10 best realm players, maybe you yourself one day can receive some of this attention that I've received. So yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm scared to log into the game sometimes because of how weird some people get. But uh, yeah. So, George Way, hopefully you don't get too much harassment, but you're a good person, obviously. Also, George Way, George is, uh, in my opinion, the single most legit player in the entire game ever. He is the only player that I know personally that has never attempted to use or speak of or think about anything TOS breaking whatsoever. So, this is the ultimate... But he's not one of those annoying anti-hackers either. He's not one of those, you know, annoying anti-hackers that are following people trying to record them to submit to DECA support because they have nothing better to do with their time. He is a humble player of this game that minds his own business and just prefers to play it without breaking TOS. So huge shout out to George Wade. Number one goes to Nep. Nep. You're such a Chad. The only thing I don't like about you is that you refuse to join my guild. You you insist that Oryx E Kittens is top guild when it's definitely not um but yeah no you're you're an awesome guy looks like you're getting closer actually uh, so I, I actually was confused about about your pronouns are you they them or him he so let me know because yeah i probably should have asked you before i made this video but you know that i'm making this video for sure i asked you permission beforehand because uh 
I, I asked you basically, man, hey, you're, you're going to get a lot of negative attention if I put you on this list, and uh, you're okay with that. You told me so. Shout out to you, Nep. I've had a lot of positive interactions with you, and um, yeah, you're in general, you you defend me when people are being toxic over the top. Uh, you, in general, have very good conduct, and you're a very friendly and uh, welcoming player. This is the kind of person that if you whisper randomly as a dark blue star, for example, you will have a good interaction with them. They're not going to call you new blue star, you know, get you know, get out of my face or anything like that. Uh, like, honestly, that's what I say to blue stars sometimes. <laughs> he, is, he is much better than I am, a lot nicer than I am. So shout out to you, Nep. You're the number one best. Realm Mad God player in my opinion. So thanks so much for watching this video and I will see you next time.